Welcome to Geeky Universe's Geeks United. Geeks United Podcast, Tuesdays, 10 30 ish. Wait a minute. Welcome to Geeky Universe's Gameplay Update. I'm David the Man Zombie, here to give you some gaming news all up in that grill. Anyway, so last Friday, Valve released part of their initiative to bring Steam into the living room by releasing their Linux based Steam OS to the masses. This is exciting news for those of us who are building a gaming rig for our living room, aka building your own console. Uh, for the rest of us, we say, yay! Ooh. Also, also, also around the same time, Valve shipped out 300 SteamOS systems to those lucky 300 beta testers. I'm sure there's a 300 joke in there somewhere, I'm just gonna give you a minute to come up with it. <laughs> Cool? Good. Let's move on. If you've been playing Battlefields for the past month or so, you may have noticed a few bugs, glitches, or even corrupted save files. But fear not, for they have finally released a patch to fix all these problems on all the platforms. Uh, examples of things that have been fixed are... Making all the maps playable. That's a really good start. Fixing corrupt file saves. And ending the one-hit kill bug. Last time I checked, that was called a headshot. Whatever. Minecraft, the immensely popular pixel sandbox game, is on the PS3. There's no word on when it will be on PS4 or PS Vita. <clears throat> but according to the PlayStation blog, they are in development. So you have to wait. Just wait. Not a big deal. It's mine. It is being released as the most recent version of the game, and the game will all have the same updates as all the rest. As all the rest. Maybe some PlayStation exclusive DLC in the future. Minecraft. Go. Go. Build stuff. Make cool things out of squares. Anyway, that's your gameplay update. David the Man Zombie, thanks for stopping in, coming by, ringing the bell. There's no bell to ring. Just come up with that 300 joke yet? Okay. <laughs>